What if I meet an atheist? Okay, fine and good. You just told me how to start up with a Christian. What about an atheist? He doesn't believe anything. He'll laugh at me. I start talking about God. Oh, I heard about God. I don't want to hear it anymore. No, no, wait a minute. Hold on. Would you like to know the proof about the monkey story? The monkey story. You remember Darwin, the monkey boy? Huh? Would you like to know that there's one religious book in the world, one, that talks about where everything really came from, almost like a science book, only better. There's one book in the world that talks about the creation but it also talks about evolution. In here, talks about evolution. About 1300 years before Darwin was even a little monkey. It tells us in here that when there is reshaping, this is Arabic meaning of it, reshaping or shaping Allah is Al-Bari. He is the evolver, the shaper, Al-Bari. No other religious book talks about this. If you'd like to know more, you should see what Allah says about the origin of everything, how it all came out of one thing that he split it. Didn't just blow it up, by the way, we're the Muslims, we're the experts on blowing up, okay? Right? They said we are. So why you come to us and talk about blowing up? Everything didn't come from blowing up. It would be a mess. No, no. It's all in order. Because it was split. It was cleft. It was divided and Allah divided everything up that's what he said in the Quran one mass and he ordered it kun fayakun first there was nothing there was nothing then Allah said kun and then there was something and then Allah said kun and it, it went out and then kun and everything that happens always Allah said kun fayakun be and it is and that's how everything came there's no such thing in reality of fire and water coming out of the same thing. This is, there's no way to prove it. So how could you imagine that here's a fire and it cools down and cools down until it becomes water? That's ridiculous. And then after it sits there as water for a long time, it got cool. It kept getting cooler and cooler. First question, why did it get cooler? And if it was getting cooler, why didn't it freeze? Why didn't it freeze? Why did it stop? And then suddenly there's life. Where did the life come from? They said, well, the water sat there so long, so long, and after a while, algae formed. Where did it come from? Here, there's a glass of water. How long do we have to let it sit for algae is going to pop up in there? Huh? How long? Well, if you got it out of the Nile River, it wouldn't take very long. <laughs> but pure water is never going to happen. It has to have it in there. And even if you have the blue-green algae that they talk about, how did it turn into a monkey? Oh, well, it went two stages. First, there were little things that came and started eating it. Where did they come from? Well, they developed out of the algae. You mean they're cannibals? And then something bigger started eating them. Where did it come from? Well, the bigger version of them, more cannibals. And then something bigger, something bigger. Hold on a minute. 
at the very end there would just be one the biggest one of all and he ate everybody else up and then he dies that's what would happen if that was true but see they don't really think about that they just make up a theory and they want to go with it because they don't want to admit there's a law the story is very big too much for tonight too much for tonight but at the end of it I simply ask him a question if human beings came from monkeys monkeys evolved you said they evolved and they became apes apes became gorillas then gorillas became you know like my brother-in-law big and ugly and then <laughs> and then suddenly all of a sudden here's a guy walking around with no hair on his body this is what they showed the children they said this is reality so that's what happened yeah so okay humans evolved and you don't have the missing link no okay so why do you still have monkeys huh how come you have all the other creatures in that link thing but you don't have this so-called missing link a little boy four years old is being taught this story about evolution and he goes people used to be monkeys yes they evolved they changed and then he says so how come we still have monkeys huh are these people that didn't evolve yet <laughs> there's a lot more about this one a lot but again we don't have time so I'm gonna make it easy for you science s-c-i-e-n-c-e -E. islam i-s-l-a-m dot com an atheist accepted Islam last week from that website and he sent me an email well actually the brother who was doing dawah to him it sent me an email I sent it back told him how to use it he said the man only visited four pages an atheist there's no God four pages a shadow la ilaha illallah a shadow Muhammad Rasulullah science islam.com uh -huh.